get into it. Yeah, I think for Battlefield, Joker can get one more little up air drag down on the platforms, and uh, Yoda Cage can get like three more up airs. So I think it's a pretty equivalent trade, if I do say so myself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you get one R set up air versus three Bowser Jr. up airs. Like, pick your poison, bro. Did you say that too? Up throw, up air, up air coming out again. Yoda getting that good damage on. 68 immediately. And now we get the jab mix ups. We're already starting the conditioning process. But guess who comes out to say hello? Mr. Arsene, how are you doing today, my good sir? The big red man is here to play. Nice shielding on that up B, hurting the down throw. And the demon has come out. The green goblin mask oh. is on. He's getting that damage on already. Aegon's going to be huge for him. I feel like Mercury's already going for a lot of these hard reads. I'm not sure because it, it put him in the quarter and now he's getting jabbed for it. So if he gets a little bit overzealous, he could find himself in dire straits. But I think he's just trying to establish that, hey, I can do anything at any moment. Be scared. Be afraid. Oh, yeah. No, that's the oh. thing. I thought he fell off. I thought he died. I was... I'm scared. I don't know what's going on here. Philly waited in bated breath at, in, t in celebration of the oh. Yoda Cage SD. <laughs> oh my god! He just he just threw him. He's like, I no longer want you to hold down the neutral. I need you to. I'm gonna chuck you at the advantage state. Have fun, my good my, my I son. once heard before the best way to fight Merc is to play just unoptimal. Like, <laughs> the, way, the way he plays, he has his own game plan and he expects certain things. And if you don't do those things, he gets upset. Yeah. Yoda is a very optimal player. That's why he has the set record over him. He's a very optimal player until he isn't. Until he does something really stupid. Like that Mega Koopa throw there. Mm -hmm. I don't know. How do you win? Why do he win against Yoshio by uh, s like spin outing in disadvantage? Why do he do that? Master mentality. Exactly. Part. Just do. I, I love. I love bringing it up because Rondor has this video that he calls like the brain buster. You do the same thing over and over again, and then you break. You break habit when you they least expect it, and then you do something really, really stupid just to like tell them habit. you don't even know what you do. And then you go back to the well after. Exactly. I mean, our son's online, and then Yoda's just kind of waiting this out, right? This is where you got to turn the brain on. If you mess up against our son, it's going to be so much damage. That forward air coming out, poking through the platform. Hold on, what's he? And I feel like this is where Battlefield starts to sort of hurt and benefit Arsene is because now Yoda Cage is going to go coast to coast because it's Battlefield. He kind of has to. But now at that point, if he's trying to camp, Yoda Cage can't really reversal. It's too scrunched for uh, Yoda Cage to get in an advantageous position from like going from corner to corner. So he kind of just has to wait it out. It's just, oh, 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 oh he actually oh. snipes him out with that clown card. That was insane. You don't even go in for elaborate setups anymore. You're just going for it. Just yeah. do it. Just do if, it. If you think it'll work, it'll work. It probably will work, and it does work. What's the risk reward here? He dies, and I take like what, 10%? Mm -hmm. I get shot by a gun. Who cares? Oh, okay, there we go. The classic. Oh, cut up by a knife. Got him. The dagger. The classic coming out from Merc. I never know what Yoda Cage is doing with his Mega Koopas. I'm gonna be perfectly honest. He kind of just throws it down and then just looks at it and then just runs away from it. It's quite literally just that meme of just go, my son, hold down the new. Yeah, he's just his own entity. You're playing doubles at that point. <laughs> literally, you can just spawn. You just spawn a doubles partner. Doubles partner getting in. Oh my god. Okay, he's going towards the ghost again. Our Sen is online. Yoda's just waiting us out. You know, if you get hit by once about this Mercury, our Sen is an absolutely no joke. A flash coming out there. He's challenging this Arsene. Yeah. I think I think the best part about it, too, is that it, it is optimal to camp out Arsene, but you're also camping out Mercury, and he tends to get very tilted very quickly. So oh. if, he, if he sees Yoda's just doing this, he's like, come on, man. Really? And that and that allows uh, Yoda to get more openings because uh, Mercury gets a little hasty, and then boom. Slip nice. up once, and then the Morton puts the hands on you. Exactly. Bowser Jr. is like the perfect like tilted character. Oh, yeah. All the options. Like, just like that. Like that. That's tilting. That he is so die. tilting. He doesn't die there, does he? Oh, my God. It was close. Mecha Koopa just barely bobbing and weaving, weaving and bobbing. But the second Mecha Koopa. That was the bait all along. Here comes the third. And now a down air up smash will most definitely kill. Does Yo How does Yoda Cage play around this? He goes straight. He, he goes back he to just staying away. You know Mercury's looking for that down air. One, two. Catch him out of the air. Oh, my gosh. Double background shield. Definitely going to poke there. Oh no! Oh no! Wait a oh, minute! Oh no! You're he kidding fumbled. me! What are you doing? What was he cooking? We have a Philly saying here: "Holy trolled, holy mid, holy trolled." He really got holy trolled. He trolled himself. That was a super troll because he used spun out, so he, he used spin out, so he couldn't uh, clown cart again, unfortunately. And then he got pineappled by the jump, and he lost just the 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 only amount of upward momentum he needed. Yoda was playing super well that game, though. Yeah, no, he was playing the matchup perfectly. You, you, it, it, you say what you want. It's an effective strategy that is in the game, and you can take. And it's not, it's not a bad strategy. It's not a gimmicky strategy. 
You just got to commit to it. And not many people have the willpower to commit to going from coast to coast. And uh, But Yoda Cage showed that he's prominent at doing so until he uh, went off stage one too many times and uh, kissed, the, kissed the underside of the boss. And yeah, that's, that happens. You, you get, sometimes you pineapple yourself, and it's okay. We're going to this game. Too. We're on Northern Cave. I'm not going to switch here from Yoda. Instead of focusing on really uh, camping out Mercury, probably more of a forward approach, I guess, this game kind of get your combos off the side of the platforms, and I'm excited to see where he takes this. Yeah, the mix-ups you Clown Cart gets off of those side platforms is unbelievable. Like, you have to ban FD, you have to ban Town, because Town allows for similar combo routes. So you're just kind of stuck with this stage. Three uh, three FDs with uh, two with two, uh, with two bans. I mean, you're going to end up here eventually. Yeah, exactly. Oh my gosh, just jumping away using that gun. Reflection? Oh my god. Mercury's tired of these mechs people, dude. <laughs> After last game, he's like, this gets nonsense out of here. I got Arsene. I'm going all the way out there. Yeah, he's getting. He's definitely getting a little bit more adventurous. And then he's like, all right, this is where Mercury starts to test the waters on how much he can get away with. Like, how much can he approach Yoda before Yoda just, like, picks an option? Mm -hmm. And then Yoda realized that and just stunted it immediately. He's like, all right, I know you're testing the waters. What if I just burst at you immediately? If you're testing the waters. I'm the shark, bro. I'm going to come out. Bam. Bite him. Get him out of there. Notoriously, those things do not let go until they, they've pulled you all the way in. No. Oh. And offstage is his pool. Those are that's, that, that, that's a Morton domain out there. That is the Yoda cage. That is the Yoda cage. Oh, Arsene's Did he online. do it again? Okay, he's good. Oh, okay, nice he's fine. Yoda playing super well. Our sense online. If Yoda just sits here and kind of waits out as long as he can, he has to deal with our send the next stock. He's going to be basically golden. Or if he even loses the stock, he's playing super well right now. Oh, yeah, he's got a whole stock, dude. Oh, back air. He's still alive. Still Amazing alive. Guy. Does not need that amount of weight. I'm not going to lie. Sen is so close to going away. Mercury needs to take a stock with Sen. Or he's in a pretty bad spot. Never mind. It's gone. Oh, my. Oh, the wow. mech put up back air. Oh, my goodness. He saw something from the from the bong set from earlier with the Toon Links, you know, when they drop bomb and then hit a forward air or something. He's like, let me try that. Let me innovate something. And then he actually got that. That's actually on. Getting that on the fly has got to be one of the best feelings as like a, a pilot of your own character because you're like I'm inventing something right now <laughs> it's like Yoda Cage being the, the best Bowser Jr. like anything he does is subject to being Twitter clipped and like right. yo guys Yoda did this we need to do this and then catch up all the way in SoCal looking at someone's like I, I've been doing this what's, what's going on <laughs> I and literally and behold it's been an established thing for the entire time and I'm just like <laughs> going crazy for no reason bro Mecha Kuba isn't that good we've been saying that oh uh uh oh uh that's yeah, that's that's fine. So these two players are in winners semis. Uh, hello, everybody watching out of state. This is not indicative of our scene. I know they both uh, yes killed it themselves. Yes, uh, it is. Yes, yeah. There, he he went to Southern Cave. He's out of there. Southern Cave. I hate that. <laughs> I could hear I could hear you giggling like a maniac, waiting for me to get it too. That's the worst part. <laughs> what a chort! Like that's a whole chortle. That's the best way I can describe how your reaction. <laughs> Uh, we do a bit of trolling. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here we go. I've What's got up? my Wawa Boba Lemonade. Boba? They got, how is that? It's all right. It's pretty good. Is it like, I mean, it's kind of Boba is it? It's not. I mean, uh, it's, I think, dragon fruit? Mm, not that sure. Popping not. bubble stuff. Yeah, it's the popping good. bubbles. And then it's just like dragon fruit lemonade. I, I, I think the bubbles are actually passion fruit. Oh, okay. Okay. Wow, this scene is trash. I know, right? Holy facts. <laughs> and the, really? And the worst part is Yoda could have like a 2-0 victory right now, except he, he he killed himself game one. That was awesome. He wanted he he wanted to, to give the content for our boy PK Sparks. Ooh, we, got, we got it. Aquarium Aquarium Park, I think it is. Yeah, Sonic music. That's the Philly Classic. S S D is the counter with Sonic music. Sonic Sonic music is like amazing. I, I don't, it's 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 great Smash music. I, I'll say that much. Oh, that's facts. I was like, when I was playing on the tournament on Tuesday, I literally was so bored with my normal soundtrack. I'm like, what if I try Sonic in the Black Knight as a soundtrack? Sonic and I, and Black Knight. Yes, I listened to that game. It's got an amazing soundtrack. I, I, like I sometimes I confuse it for Xenoblade One music. I'm not gonna lie. It's it sounds kind of similar. It, it's it's good. You need to listen to it. You know what? I might. I, I did like that game when I was younger. Anyways, the black knight is uh, the red knight is out actually. He's easier to play. Hmm. Uh -huh. It's so weird that our is red. It's just the the blue aura is so captivating. Well, people call him the blue man. I always took the red man catching the, the red man catching it with the up air. Merc is T. Oh my gosh, he's he's playing with them. He's and then to, he's trolling. And then Yoda. I don't even know how often it is to stay up there at this point because you get less invincibility the longer you hang up on the halo. Oh my. Oh. Okay. Just these random spin outs, like you said, just like the randomness is sometimes all you need. It's like Merc's brain is a like a like a hard boiled egg. Er, not a hard boiled egg, but like a 
like an egg. Yeah. And you just take some chopsticks and just wiggle it around, and now it's a scrambled egg. And know what yeah, yeah. So I got it. It's, uh, Yoda never plays like that. I don't know what he's on. If he's on one, if he's on a Mecha Koopa or something. Sometimes I find success by like, all right, I'm going to do something stupid here, and then it ends up working. So I test it again. I'm like, it's not your entire play style. Oh, with Luigi it is. Yeah. But sometimes I'll do it with Fox. Okay, that's pretty fun. Oh, he's waiting for it. <laughs> he still got hit by it. He got. <laughs> 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 the perfect storm. The uh, tethers automatically pull up after a certain point, so he's just like, "Hey guys!" Is that actually? That's hilarious. yeah. They actually they do. You can't hang there forever. They auto, they auto pull up at a certain at a certain point. You can refresh it by like holding down and then canceling the tether and then tethering again. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. like, <clears throat> oh my God, I think it was too late. Out there with the Arsene. I right, 57. I mean, if it doesn't do anything with Arsene, if Yoda waits it out, he'll be in a pretty good spot. But Mercury really just needs one hit, and he'll just close the stock. Do you know what Mercury needs? He needs a grab. I Whenever it's at 100%, I never see this guy grab. He hits Arsene, and then he always back airs, waiting for you to commit to something out of shield, so he can commit to something out of shield as well, put you off stage with, like, pokes and whatnot. I never That's see him grab against Yoshio. The poke against in question. Yes. Sometimes it just works. Sometimes you can brute force through it because you're playing Arsene, and you got one of the best back... It, Arsene backers the best backer in the game. I'm just going to say it. Exactly. Oh. Koopa. Oh my gosh, Yoda went for a crazy setup there. Not able to find it. He's at 6%. There we go. That's not going to take it. I would not have DI'd that correctly. That that looked ugly. And just like that, he's back. Oh, he's not. I don't know if that jab was a play there, because now our son's about to come back online. This is huge for Mercury. If we can get anything anything done with this Arsene, he's in a really good spot. This extra credit about to be huge if he finds a hit. And it's all about momentum, too, because if Yoda Cage finds this hit, he's going to the next stock feeling amazing. But if he starts taking, like, 30, 40, and then it starts mounting, that's when it becomes, like, uh -oh. unfortunately bad. There's the back air. We huge for Merc. I've gone 30%. Yoda needs to hit the stock, like, literally yesterday. Look, just throwing it, and it's working. He's camping He's camping at a deficit, and he's getting hit. And this is where the 60%. Now you're chilling, because their ascend's gone. Doesn't need my majority. Where is this percent coming from? He's already at 85. He's at 92. About to be at 100 percent. Mercury waiting here in this ledge. Oh my gosh! Goes to whiff punish. And side be just barely missing that. Could have sworn that was Merc's kill screen. That was crazy. Now. And now it's yo and now it's Merc's turn to camp until he gets our send. You know, you know the game of tag your it. Yeah, yeah. You, whoever's it is whoever if is if he has our send or not. This is freeze tag. Oh I didn't God. kill. Why is why is this character so heavy, man? I don't know. I mean, he's literally driving a car. That might be it. Oh. He was not be doing much there. Landing with the gun on the shield. Mercury looking to close out with anything right now. Can't get too overzealous because this is still Yoda we're talking about. Don't jump, don't jump. Okay, good. So many people get trolled in this position and they get too comfortable against Yoda. Sometimes, yeah. Don't like, want to be you. All Yoda needs is one little setup. He needs center stage and then he can put you off stage. And that's where he becomes really scary because Bowser Jr. is a gimmicky character at heart, but that gimmick is less trapping and edge guarding. But sometimes all you need is a little bit of an Arsene boosted forward tilt. And the game three is going to go in Mercury's favor after an unfortunate game one and an even more unfortunate game two.